we've been proud to call it our original hometown. New tonight at 6 o'clock, after 75 years, the pride of Crooksville is no more. The city is losing its high school football stadium, home to the Ceramics Varsity football team. Ceramic pride is the best. Home games here, uh, as of right now, uh, will not be played here. Tonight's game ball will be flown in by the Crooksville alum, Master Sergeant Clint Crooks. Clint, make some noise, baby. Clint has served 19 years in active duty for the U.S. Marine Special Operations Command. From the moment Larry Iman picks up his bow. He just gets up there and he's standing in a spot and he's in his zone. When his arrow pierces its target, the Crooksville Junior is one of the top high school archers in the country. You get a possible score of 300 and like my average is around 297. My highest is 299. The two-time state champ from Corning has honed his skills for years. First started shooting when I was about three. But dominating competitions almost didn't happen. He didn't want to do it because to him it looked like a little kid's bow. But uh, we pushed him, basically drug him into it. The first day he was in, he was pretty much hooked on and it. just one of them will represent the Crooksville Ceramics and the Buckeye State. In Perry County, Pat Chiesa, WHIZ Sports. I grew up here. My whole family's went here. We're not like any other school. Being a ceramic is something to be proud of. And because this is Redneck City, that's an old Copenhagen can. Out of all the things you can find in Crooksville, spark plug. 